E News, your local news, brought to you by the Stone County Enterprise. Racial hate crime. No child should be in fear of going to school. No child should be walking down the hall or in the locker room and be accosted with a noose around their neck. This is 2016, not 1916. This is America. This is a place where children should go to school and feel safe in their environment. We call on the Stone County School District to take immediate action to rectify this situation in accordance with their policy. Their policy is very clear that if a child is assaulted in school, that those who are involved should be expelled immediately. Amen. That has not happened. We are called attention to this incident to ensure it is not swept under the rug and this child who was accosted is provided the proper safety in this school. An incident which allegedly occurred at Stone High School has turned into a national story about race relations in Stone County. The Mississippi State Conference of the National Association for the Advancement of Colored People held a news conference Monday on the grounds of the Stone County Courthouse. Derek Johnson, president of the state conference, said four white students had placed a noose around the neck of a black student, backed away, and tightened the noose. The NAACP is calling for a federal investigation into what it has labeled a racial hate crime. Representatives of the Stone County School District and Stone High School have declined to comment on the charges. Stone County Sheriff Mike Farmer said his department would conduct an investigation into the matter and, if necessary, subpoena records from the school district. He advised, though, that as a hate crime, the incident would fall under the jurisdiction of the Federal Bureau of Investigation, and its investigation would supersede any investigation by the Stone County Sheriff Department. See Wednesday's print edition of the Stone County Enterprise for the entire story.